hey, wanted to make this video to uh, show you a little bit of what we got going on here. Uh, first of all, welcome to our first video of our series. Uh, this is a series um, where we're gonna blog and document everything about Maya's delivery and puppies and uh, puppies being delivered and puppies growing and uh, everything that we're gonna teach the puppies. Um, part of our program we do uh, we do crate training, we do leash training, and we do personality and temperament testing for all of our puppies. And this is before they turn eight weeks old. Oh, and potty training. So by the time they turn eight weeks old and they are going home, they have all these skills and they can be successful at their new home. And then uh, families can be successful at taking on these puppies and just helping them thrive, helping them be the best they can be. Some of these puppies are gonna go out to be service dogs. Some of them are gonna be therapy dogs. Some of them are going to be a facility dog. Some of them are gonna be emotional support dogs. Some of them are gonna be pets. Uh, and just growing with families and kids. So that's part of what we do with our program. We love what we do. We love our program. We love our dogs. And uh, if you can't tell, we love to put a lot of time and energy into our puppies to make them thrive, um, make them be good puppy citizens out in the world. So I want to show you, uh, we have Maya sleeping back there. I don't know if you can see her. She's right there. Um, we, uh, she just had dinner. So <laughs> she's sleeping and Frida's back there too, uh, sleeping with her. Uh, you can see a little bit of our whelping area. Uh, I don't know how much you can see, but we've worked on this little area just for her to be comfortable, to for us to have all the tools we need. Uh, we actually have, you can see it back there, yeah, right there. And another one right here, we have our security cameras, uh, ring cameras monitoring Maya, movement, sound, especially during the day, we've been having to go to work for, um, Dahlia's having to go all day long, I'm having to go half a day. Uh, in person so we definitely need to monitor Maya as much as possible especially now that uh, we're on high alert today is day 59 after breeding after Ty so she should be due anytime now any day now uh, her last litter she delivered puppies on day 59 so and it was the night of day 59 so we could have puppies tonight uh, who knows fingers crossed that uh, yeah, she doesn't throw a surprise uh, or anything, but uh, we want to be ready and we are ready. We actually have all of our supplies right up here, um, blankets, towels, everything we need. We actually build this area, as you can see on this video, we have two zones, uh, two boxes, I guess, box one, box two, and we actually let her choose which one she wanted. She actually likes this one, box one, and uh, we have flooring, uh, you can see we have flooring and we added carpet just for warmth and um, insulation and then plenty of blankets and then she got to choose either one and uh, she's been sleeping in this one, she likes this one. Um, of course she sleeps with her blankets that she's been sleeping with. So yeah, everything's been clean, sanitized and um, whenever we get puppies, uh, we'll, be, we'll be ready. Uh, we have some uh, really essential things such as towels uh, and other things. If you hear any sounds, it's my wife. She's upstairs cleaning. Uh, this area is actually in the basement of our house. We adapted our basement to be this area. And uh, no, we are not sleeping upstairs. We're actually sleeping in the basement. The basement has plenty of room. My wife is right here. The basement has plenty of room, so our bed is up there and we actually brought down a TV and a table and a couch, uh, some jackets. Uh, we pretty much moved into the basement just to be here with Maya and uh, again, just being on high alert, being ready for whatever happens. Uh, and we have another couch. I have our couch right here um, in case we have to sleep in the couch just to be right next to her if needed. Uh, we also brought down our crates. Uh, so Frida and Emilia are staying in, her, in their crates here in the basement with us. We have, I don't know if you can see, we have this railing here uh, and it runs all the way around. Um, this just helps protect the area for Maya and uh, give her more privacy. That way 
Milia and Frida don't come in here and then whenever uh, puppies get delivered they won't bother her. Uh, it does have a doggy door so Maya can get in and out as she needs but it also helps to separate from the other dogs and she can have her privacy. We have some lights, just Christmas lights that we hung around. Uh, again, it helps with the cameras and they can, it lights up the area and we're able to, again, be able to monitor her a lot better. So yeah, that's what's going on with her. And uh, all thanks Maya. This is, like I said, video number one of our series. Uh, we're starting today because we know delivery day is going to be soon and we want to be ready and uh, we'll show you when puppies get here and then try to vlog at least once a week to show you how these puppies are progressing and growing and learning and playing and just exploring the world but for now Maya is sleeping so is Frida and I think she's ready to do her thing pretty soon and we'll be, we'll be updating you. If you're one of our families on our list, you'll get all the updates in our group that we have. Uh, if you're just watching, we hope you enjoy these videos. If you have any questions, feel free to message us, uh, leave a comment, uh, follow our Instagram account at Hey Doodles. Uh, hey Dude Doodles, I'll put it right there. So if you're watching on Instagram, you already follow our Instagram account. So yes, that's our update on our doggies. And thank you for joining us on this journey. Stay tuned, we'll post more videos and uh, definitely stay on the stories. The stories, we'll be posting a lot more on our stories. We'll post some pictures here and there, but stories is where all the action is going to be at. And then you'll get you'll get to see a blog uh, once a week. Yeah, that's, uh, that's the update and uh, stay tuned for more videos to come.